Hello everyone, this is uh, Antonio from uh, Random Stuff uh, channel and I'm back again with another video on desktop um, issues. I'm on my Linux machine, as you can see, and um, occasionally I do use my Linux machine. I love the, uh, the comp is uh, effects and um, one of the things that really bothers me is uh, when some of the uh, drives uh, go missing. And if you've had this, if you look in the description of the video, um, I'll uh, list it there. Basically, um, some drives, for example, this one here, I can double click on it and I can see the, the actual contents. Uh, let's go back. Um, also this one here, this is also fine, no problem. But, so, uh, but this one, for example, that I want to see, gives me this uh, error message, which is probably what you've got and why you found this particular video um, today. So unable to mount location, error mounting, blah, blah, blah. If you, if you Google this, you'll find lots of documents and um, you know this is how I found the solution. But I want to document this and, uh, and keep it in, in the list of my videos also for myself uh, as occasionally I do come back to Linux and I get these stupid errors that, uh, errors that annoy me. The, um, the typical things that I save are things like how to change the default grub boot entry with uh, gedit. Um, you know, so that when you start your machine in the dual boot configuration, you can select which one to start first and how many seconds, etc., before it goes into that operating system. Now, in order to fix this issue, you need to go into um, your applications and look for the disks uh, application, which is, um, if I right click just to show you the properties, the name of it is GNOME Disks. And, uh, oops, see some of this nice sometimes silly effects that you get on this uh, it's called known discs excuse my voice I've got a, a cold and um, you can you can find that with uh, synaptic manager or your software manager depending on which version of Linux that you're on I'm actually on uh, on links so um, the way you fix this is um, you go into this particular one here uh, so you launch it and uh, you can see here the disks, I have two in my machine. I've got my SSD, which is where I've got my Windows uh, installed. And then I've got my one terabyte hard disk, which is where I have my Linux uh, partition. Now, the drives that, um, that you saw before, um, if I just move that to the side and go back, the drives that you see here uh, are self-explanatory on here. So the reason why I'm able to get into, say, for example, this one and, uh, and you know, actually look at files without any problems whatsoever because of the flags so if I right click on this so if I go into the uh, more actions you can see in the edit mount options I've turned off automatic mount options and I've uh, added the comma and uh, RO which is probably uh, read only uh, I'm not 100% sure check it out online if uh, if you want to know what it means um, but I know that this is what you need to put in here in order to have the drive um, load when you start your Linux uh, instance uh, by doing that and then doing okay you probably get your uh, the request for your password and then it saves it and it works now if you look at the one that doesn't work which is my 215 so if I just go back here and double click it unable to mount location what you do is you you go into the uh, edit mount options you turn it off you come to this line here you add the comma and ro and you do okay now mount at startup is up to you you know i i've left them like this but you can change them so that it doesn't mount on startup and um show uh, in user interface as well you you, you can take that off or, or leave it on is it just play about with it as, uh, as you wish but what i normally do is take off mount at startup and do okay uh, then i put my password now when I come here you see I can go in without any problems so uh, that's it um, I can right click and do unmount without any problems right click unmount um, I hope this has helped anyone out there who's having this issue um, even if it's only my uh, my own version of many solutions that you'll find out there okay so until the next one take care cheers